Good morning, YouTube. I think you recognize this garage. Uh, we need to go, go say hi to someone who I'm sure a lot of you know. Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> what are you doing? Uh, uh, meditating. You're uh, early. I I am. Uh, oh. This is the 599. It, it is the Venusia 599. I was Venusia. I was meditating oh. with it. So are you recording all of the nefarious activities? First of all, you might have a car for me. I do have a car for you. I so desperately want something for this car that I'm letting you club me over the head and steal something from me. My most prized possession in the entire world outside of my children you're getting. <laughs> yes. We'll take it. We'll take okay. It. Well, yeah, yeah. So we'll, we'll make a little deal then. I, I think we could get you hooked up with that. Okay. There's something you want to do that. I don't know what it is. People yes. have been talking about it. Obviously. We'll talk about it. Right. And then you got something else and that, yeah, we could do a little swap and Yeah, the car is not here because this is where I keep all the junk. The nice cars are somewhere else. The nice car. Oh, that's right. Yes. The this nice is the creme de la creme. So this is the junk. This is the junk storage. We'll go where the nice things are, <laughs> where the thing is that you want. Um, but uh, yes, would, would you like a tour? I would absolutely. Okay. Well, yes. they're not all Ferraris, so I don't know if your audience. Will. Well, I know at least that and that. Well, the Italians. We know the Italians. Kind of. Yes. Yes. So the yellow '96 355, the rock spec, which was uh, bought in Houston, needing all the things, and it's been wonderful since we had all the things. Enough for me to sell the 9348 with 100,000 miles, which I thought I'd never sell. A 66 Mustang that's a Hertz rent racer that turned into is a it, race car. Is it a real Hertz? Real. Oh my god. Real Shelby registry, Shelby VIN, and then it was a Hertz rental car that was bought out a few years later. And no later. one stole the engine? No. Well, that's long gone. It's, it, it, yeah, it's not the original engine. Oh. But oh. Um, yeah, it was a, it was a hill climb racer and dragster. It had a bunch of different motors in it in the 70s and 80s. And oh, that's kind of cool though. Then made into a Group B race car so I can do that Monterey Stork races or Sonoma or whatever, but I'm not qualified to do it. Next to it, 66 Corvette 427. Ooh. Leaking onto a 1989 <laughs> Lamborghini Countach, 25th anniversary edition. I found that a few miles from my house. Guy, a neurosurgeon lived on a dirt road. I saw road. that video, that was fascinating. Yep, I bought that and a Diablo from the guy on the same day. I've since sold the Diablo to, to Marion. So that's that's the survivor. That's the dumbest, the plate on the back. Uh, 2001 Bentley Azur. Formerly owned by Jean-Claude Van Damme. No way. Yes. I bought it for $25,000. He paid $300,000 for it. New. Can you do the splits now? Uh, that, I'm not, <laughs> I'm not as flexible. I mean, that's, anyway. <laughs> SLS AMG, love the glowing doors. Z8. Yeah. That has the right transmission in it, the manual. Yeah, Ooh. so, oh, yes. um, not the Alpino with the automatic. So that's pacifying me until, until, you get her done there. Uh, the uh, yeah. Speaking of flappy paddles, oh, my dog thinks somebody just oh they <laughs> they heard the knock. Anyway, he's all right. Uh, 2003 Aston Martin Vanquish. This is a former car trek car. Yep. The 2021 Shelby GT500 Grabber Yellow. 49. Uh oh, I'm forgetting. Okay, now I'm starting to forget. Yeah, 49 Cadillac. Uh, nice. Fastback. 06 Mercy Lago. A lot of flappy paddles here. Yeah. Um, yeah. B to see you, 599. And then the new arrival, yeah. fresh in, um, the slight El Flambe, but cheapest SLR McLaren Roadster in the USA. Now that is fantastic. Uh, you're telling me the story behind that. You guys need to go watch his video about that. It's a cool story. It's fantastic. Yes, yep. There's a few more cars outside, like uh, a Ram that I just turned over with a million miles, which, how, really? how are you doing on your Ram? I already got 40,000, 44,000. You just broke it's a it baby. In. Yeah. My, I mean, one. let's be real. That's a Cummins with a Dodge around it. Oh, right. Yes. Yeah, no one wants to admit that it's actually a Dodge. But original Cummins just turned over 1 million miles. Oh, my God. No yep. rebuilds? Yep. No rebuilds. Yep. Fantastic. Yep. Bought it. It was a hot shot truck for the oil fields. Oh, I yeah. bought it, you know, after it was what retired year? from there. So, 2004. <laughs> Yep, all the cars. There's the CTSV, Suburban, and other things, but uh, not what you came to see. Like I said, yes, this is where we keep the junk, the really nice stuff, the priceless item that you are stealing from me, is somewhere else. So, oh. should we go there? Yeah, I assume you want to take this. Yes. All right. I like five and nines. <laughs> I need the key. Oh yeah. I feel like we're missing something there. Yeah. Ever since I drove your car, there's like this. Phantom me wanting to do this. Are you, are you like stomping the floorboards? It's not happening. Instead, there's a robot that is making my neck jerk around every once in a while because I don't, I can't predict what it's doing. It's not bad though. I mean, it's just, it's no. just not a gated manual compared to say like a 
355. Oh, yeah. that's a thing. Uh, the bike get out oh, too hard. Oh, your vent came out. Yeah, you know. Ferrari. Yeah, it's Ferrari. Yeah. I'm just happy it started because I didn't have it on a tender and it was sitting for a week. Oh, yeah. That's actually good, good fortune. Popped right over. Yeah. We'll see if this other one does because it's been sitting for a wee bit longer or not on a tender. Uh oh. All right, you guys. We are at Hoovy's secondary storage and he's going to show us some amazing cars, including the one that we're going to be buying from him. That's right. It's, it's pretty awesome. You're going to love this. Yeah, there's. Uh, some other hoopties in here. Oh, that's actually my first car, that Mercedes SL right oh, there. Are you kidding? Yeah, my grandma got it new, gave it to me when I was 16. Uh, we'll go all the way right. Uh, Beck Spider, but it's Subaru powered. So that's kind of fun. A WRX engine in there. Oh, nice. Jurassic Park Jeep. 2,000 miles. This isn't mine, but it's a 2013 Ferrari 458 Spider with only 2,000 miles. Oh. And you're not here for that. You're here for the best car yeah. in the room. What's better than that? Well, how about a 2013 Ferrari 458 with uh, 90,000 miles on it? <laughs> That's it? Right? It's a baby. Yeah, just broken in. I mean, all this nonsense about cars being high mileage of their Ferrari with 30,000 miles, it's, it's just baloney. Oh, it's total and crap. It may have had some minor off-road excursion. It went into a ditch and was wrecked in the front and back and put together by apes. Uh, repair wise. You mean that's not factory gap right there? I, well, that may be Italian, you know, they were just <laughs> Friday evening ready to get out. But, uh, yeah, it's a, it's a car. It's the world's cheapest Ferrari 458. It's probably the only 458 that runs and drives all in one piece to transact for under a hundred grand. Yeah, that sounds about right. But that's because it has all the miles, probably a track <laughs> rental. Uh, yeah, WRX brakes there. GTR steel brakes there, but they swore, the person who sold it to me swore it wasn't a track rental, which... Yeah. Right. How else so, did you get that many miles? <laughs> yeah, and then the, uh, yeah, the ditch adventure. So, uh, the front was ripped off, and the rear, I think it was just the bumper, and, you know, obviously the side skirts. Yeah, side A lot skirt. of scrapage under there, but, you know, actually pretty and that solid. one subframe kind of was, like, shaped like a U. But oh, yeah, just hammer that back down, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Yes, claim your prize. Woohoo! Congratulations! Thank you, thank you. It does have an exhaust too, right? You put that on. Oh yes, yes. What, what, what exhaust, exhaust do we get? Yeah, Valvetronic exhaust. Ooh. Very gold. Well, yeah. so I didn't do the gold thing. Oh. The wheels were gold before. Oh. We peeled off the black paint and discovered that the horsey was gold. And we're like, well, we should just continue this theme. Yeah, of, stick uh, with gold, man. I love gold! He's porn star, you know, kind of, yeah. Oh wow, it's even got carbon fiber on the rear. Oh, I was missing a tooth there, but... Oh. Thing's horrible. You just keep giggling. It just keeps getting better. Oh, okay. The gift that keeps giving. The seatbelts do work, right? Good. Yeah. You know what makes me wonder about when cars get like this? It's like, how does that happen? Like, who, who cracks that? The what? Right here. Right here on the dash, there's a crack in the carbon fiber. Like, how does oh. that happen? Well, the wife was a little frisky, and uh, like, oh, I, I guess, know. yeah, it could be. That's the only thing I can think of. Ships are good. Yes. Yeah, there's no way that transmission has never been apart, I imagine. Oh, yeah, probably. Yeah. Well, at least once. Yeah. Especially if they were tracking it. Whoop! Yeah. Curb there. Yeah, it's the good. Bumpers are already. Yeah. I mean, who needs scrape guards? You don't need to worry about it. That's yeah. the thing. You just go. I mean, take it to Walmart. <laughs> Take to McDonald's. Keys in, make sure your insurance is up to date. Right. Oh wow. That something's weird there. What's that? The right pedal. They have to pull it excessively far to get the click. Well. Oh yeah. Look at that. Got a little play. A little bit of play. That's what's here. Nice. I can't. Why don't I? <laughs> All right. What, what are we seeing here? Look at. Come on. Really? Well, I'm just noticing oh. things. It's it's not terrible. <laughs> yes, out the gate. You can hit the gate if you want because oh, yeah. we should. It's already. I can almost fit under it. Oh, you can try. It's not like it's gonna hurt anything. It's I, definitely the best car I've ever driven. I can see you falling in love right now. Oh yeah. There is something appealing about having an amazingly awesome car that you really don't give a shit about. Right. 
finally see if she... Oh, oh you scraped it! Scraped. What how, have I done? How dare you! How oh, dare I? Right, here we go. Wow. Yeah, the tar's a little cold, so it's chattering. But oh, yeah. It's slippery, but... How about that? I mean, yeah, it feels... It feels, feels about the same? Under a little bit, like underpowered a little, but it's close, and the uh, transmission is uh, a little slower than normal, uh, but not terrible. It's not terrible. I like the uh, custom sun visor deletes. Oh yeah, isn't that something? Yeah, that's pretty. It's, it's about right. Well, that's a good shift. Yeah. I'm not used. To <laughs> the, see the the. Looseness of this has screwed me up because I'm used to just, you know, you got a quick tap and you got to really pull it. Okay. It's just, like, it's just weird. Just little things. That, yeah. You know, it almost feels like it's twisted or something. I don't know. Something's weird there. Yeah. It's pretty solid. The engine's yes. Definitely doing good. You know, when the, with the track little stuff, they have people that fix them in house, obviously. So you really don't know. What's happened? They're not taking it to the Ferrari dealer for stuff, you know. So, <laughs> so you gotta wonder. Oh, that actually it'd almost be worth it. Just take it to the Ferrari dealer. Left. Right. Yeah, left. Just to see how sad and disappointed they would be. Like, what happened to our baby? Oh, there was definitely a rattle in that suspension. Okay. Yeah, it is. It was just the tires. Yeah. Cold tire. The uh, traction control is going nuts. Yeah, it's cold tire chatter. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so power is probably about right. Mm -hmm. I mean, for 88,466 miles, that's spot on. I'm sure there's a tiny bit of carbon buildup in there. Just a tiny. <laughs> they got additives in AutoZone that'll fix that right up. Sure. We'll do some sea foam or something. Yeah. Some Quaker State, high mileage, whatever. Yeah, yeah exactly. Oh, hey, does the Manatino work? It does! Oh, I mean, yay! Yeah, the, the LED in the steering wheel shifter, though, is oh, not. it's dead? No. It is dead. That's too bad. Does the wipers work? Oh, they do! That's good. We came back to where it was before. These, oh, look at the look at the leather up there. Oh, yes. It's like an anaconda, you know, <laughs> kind of shed its skin. <laughs> and then, uh, yeah, I left it there. Yeah, exactly. I was going to say, someone went flaccid there, but... Oh, yeah, I suppose. Yep. Wow, that's terrible. Poor thing. The rest of the dash, actually. Yeah, that's why. Oh, uh, well, Binnacle. Okay. Binnacle needs some love. Oh, yeah, it's kind of... Yeah, the whole Binnacle's screwed. Just close your eyes and drive. I was a little scared about, like, is it going to smell just because of the age? And it... Excuse me? What? Is that because of you? Older cars start to get like a funk, and it's leather, so it's gonna absorb all that funk. I mean, think about it. There's been a, no. there's literally been at least one human ass in this car for 88,468 miles now. Yes. That's a lot of ass. Yeah. Yes. That has a lot of possibility of stinking. Okay. And it's, let's be real, it's gonna be mostly dudes. Right. So you got sweaty man ass in this seat for 88,000 miles. Well, I don't think these seat covers are original, but mm. yeah, they're kind of yeah that too. Yeah, that's, that's like a that's bullying. a that's a fun thing. That can be fixed. Yeah. So does it meet your expectations? I mean, it's about what I expected for a hundred thousand dollar four five eight. The joke in the fry world is, it doesn't matter if you pay. Like, let's say this car in perfect condition is worth two hundred thousand dollars. Yeah. It wouldn't matter. If you bought it for 100 or 200, you're gonna. It's gonna cost 200. I suppose if you wanted it. If you to, want it to be the same condition. Right. So whenever you get a bargain Ferrari, they still cost the same. If you want it to be at the condition of the high-end Ferrari. That was probably true up until you know recently with the rapid appreciation and everything else. That you know sometimes you could yes. sneak something. Yeah, there was definitely an anomaly in the, especially the 458s. They went even more than yeah, a lot of the other Ferraris. Exactly. Because so, I would say, like that 2,000 mile spider in there is, you know, probably oh. knock on the door 300. Oh yeah, easily. So yeah, easily. same year, same car, 100 grand. Yeah, this is uh, it's yeah, just, this one could never be worth what that one. Oh no, never. 
still sort of like basically everything's fine. Yeah, we had it on the track and cars track and it it did fine. Yeah. It, it it really never even got angry. The suspension's tight. Mm -hmm. Like surprising enough, there's not really much of a rattle in the interior. No, no, that's <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Like, I was, I was thinking, oh, it's just going to be like, you know, like, like yeah. every time you hit a bump, but it's not. Yeah, you're trailering at home. You should just, you should just split up and drove it home. I should have. I would have, but, you know, I was all alone. Yeah. Lonely. The driving is really pretty solid. Mm hmm Appearance, we'll give it like, like a, a three out of ten. Oh, we're almost out of gas, too. Hey, the gas gauge works, apparently. Yeah. Boy, it went down two notches in one... Oh, because we hit the brakes, probably. Yeah. Yeah. So, do we have a deal? Uh, yeah. Yeah. You idiot. <laughs> <laughs> On camera, right? No, it's, no, it's, it's, no. can't back out now. Uh, exactly. Yeah. It's who's... Yes! Yes! <laughs> what a sucker. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Suddenly, who <laughs> went deaf? <laughs> That? That in here? Oh, that? Uh, yeah. Oh. Yeah, I'm... Some, oh, yeah, some plastic panels that are definitely uh, not bolted all the way. Something going plop plop. Yep. Yeah. Because there are a lot of missing yeah, plastic there's, there's screws like and things. just a couple missing screws out of the front. <laughs> just a couple. You make it right. Okay.